Let us say it again. Let's lift our hands and thank the Lord right now. Come on, everybody. Tell him thank you. Thank you. Have you got anything to thank him for? You all to tell him thank you. Hallelujah. In this service, we're certainly glad to have young lady uh, Catherine Wright in our midst that was incarcerated at uh, Scottsdale, uh, pardon me, Scott's Regional Correctional Facility. She's going to come now and leave her testimony. This young lady was saved in prison and was paroled seven years in advance, seven years in advance, seven years ahead of time, seven years ahead of time. God save. I'm going to let her give you her testimony. Look, Christy, right here. Praise the Lord, everybody. Praise the Lord, everybody. Giving honor to God who's the head of my life. Truly, God has been good to me. I mean, down through the years, he has been good to me. Praise the Lord. I've been incarcerated ever since 91. But the Lord sent me there for a reason. To get myself in order with him. Hallelujah. And I've got saved, sanctified, and Holy Ghost filled inside prison. But let me tell you something. Hallelujah. They gave me a 10 to 30 sentence. Their judge told me I wasn't fit for society. He told me he was going to lock me away and I can't come home until 2000. Hallelujah. Yeah. But let me tell you, God, before you, who can be against you? Who can be against you? Nobody. But as I was in prison, hallelujah, I began to grow in the Lord and know that he's worthy and that he's good. And that he chases the ones that he loves. Hallelujah. And he said, I'll never forsake you, no leave you. And keep your eyes on me. And no matter what man say, I am a deliverer. And as I sit back and let God deliver me out of the hands of prison. Don't you know I went back in front of that same judge. And as he began to look me over, he couldn't understand it. But I know what God was doing. Hallelujah. See, I was living right. I gave up the wicked and started living for God. Hallelujah. And so as he began to look over the little letters that the people wrote for me, even the sister warden wrote a letter on my behalf. Hallelujah. God will give you favor with anybody if you walk right. Hallelujah. He'll give you favor with anybody. I'm telling you, hallelujah. With the sister warden writing letters on my behalf. Hallelujah. And I wouldn't even incarcerated for two years then. But let me tell you what God done for me. Hallelujah. That judge who said I wouldn't fit. He said I wouldn't fit that same judge. He said I see a change in you. He seen the Holy Ghost. He seen a child of God. Hallelujah. And don't you know he said I'm going to cut you loose. Because I see a change in you. Don't you know the Lord let me come home November the 5th, 1993? Hallelujah. I came home. And I did it say, God, I just want to tell God, you just who you say you is. And Pastor Ellis, my joy bells. Come on, tell us briefly. He ran all the way. I know what she's talking about. 